Hello everyone, my name is Christopher Sivrasov. My name is Mustafa Alessi. And this is Project Loka, advised by Professor Sarush Patel. So let me ask you something. Are you tired of cutting your grass? Tired of wasting all that amount of time and energy in the sun? Well, this is the best thing that ever happened to you. So Project Low Cut is designed to eliminate the time and energy wasted by users when cutting their grass every day. So over here we have the first prototype, prototype one of Project Low Cut. As you see, it's a lot different from prototype two. They're both built using the Lego kit, where there are a few uh, adjustments and modifications that we chose to do for the first part one, and then we also added on later in part two. The main modification is we have the four borders over here. These control the blades over here on the bottom. They're not here right now because they're on the second prototype, as you can see over here. We also have two switches right here. These can turn on the four motors to activate each one of these blades uh, if you choose to do so. And then also we have the Arduino uh, board which you can program easily uh, through the software that's provided with the Lego kit. Yeah. So differences between prototype one and prototype two. Main differences you can see is height. You can see this one's about a good inch and a half off the ground compared to this one. We had a problem in prototype one where the blades, so you see how low this is right now? Yeah. The blades are already in the ground. You can't spin if you're in the ground. So we had to raise it up a little bit. We added a shield for protection because you don't want any animals or little kids sticking their feet under there. Also, uh, as you can see in prototype one, we have these regular switches. Prototype two, we upgraded and we went with a transistor and a diode. That then controls the two motors at the bottom from the Adreno board. We use pin 13 on our board and there's still, let's see, we still probably got 12 more pins to use up from everything that we have on here. The Bluetooth module we use is the HCOA, which is fully compatible with the app that we have, which is the Allegro uh, BLE tool. Now, I'm going to connect and give you guys a little demonstration. So all you have to do is turn it on from the side. Unlike this one, you'd have to turn it on and hit the switch for both the motors to come on. Here, we can control it from here. So in the app, you will go to uh, connection. You'll first connect. It says I'm connected to HC08, which is this one right here. So we have, I'm trying to do this backwards, sorry. So we have forward, stop, we got back, stop. We can go right angle, which is 45 to the right. We can go left angle, which is 45 to the left. We can go, and you can drive it like a regular RC car if you want. You also have an emergency stop. Yeah, just, just in, in case. case anything goes wrong. Oh, Which else it, fails. It overrides <laughs> the regular stop. This is especially used for the automation that you see over here in the bottom. So we have record, conclude, and play. So how it works is, you know, as you've seen before, you can press forward, stop, back, stop. If you have that recorded, and then you press conclude, you can easily just play that over again, and it will easily just do everything that you just did. So, so the emergency stop is just mostly used when you're in automation form. Anything happens, anybody comes across, just press the emergency stop button, and it will completely stop. Okay, so as you can see in the app, we have this button called motors. Motors is what controls the two motors that cut at the bottom. All you have to do is just tap it, and voila, it will start up. Okay, so to demonstrate, we put prototype one in the middle. Yep. We're gonna make a box around this, bring it back, and then we're gonna hit play and have it do that by itself. Yep. All right, so now I'm connected. I'm gonna mark my starting point, which is right here. So now I'm gonna hit record, mm -hmm. and I will drive it around. So forward, stop. So all those little mess ups I just made, they're all gonna come be into popped it. up. I'm not the best driver. Huh? Alright, so now we're gonna hit conclude and we're gonna hit play. So I'll go out and it will legit do every yeah, single man. mess up that I made. I went forward, back. We can show you that we're not doing anything. Yeah. I can just put the phone down. It's doing everything on its own. What's the impressive part about it? is that it will learn what you're doing. Yep, and back see, to start point one. And it up where it started. Yeah. 
So that's the impressive part about it is that it can easily repeat whatever you put in.